Good evening, everyone. My name is Terry Jing Lang Liao, which is uh, so today I'm glad to introduce our senior project, Renamed iLost, which is an uh, indoor navigation system. <laughs> <laughs> so, why we need an indoor navigation system? Because we can imagine a scenario about if you're working in a uh, large shopping center, for example, the South Coast Plaza, and you may get lost in the back building, and if you're looking for some stores and maybe you could not find it uh, because you have to go a long way to find that map. Then the, and some and other things, when I f came to the first class about the, uh, the semester starts, I may could not find the, could not find my classroom and then you can use the ILOS you can find your classroom, you not be late. Yeah. So our goal is to develop a, like a GPS system just compatible for indoor environments. So, this uh, schematic shows how it works for our system. However, we use the wireless transmission technology called iBeacon, which is using the Bluetooth low energy. You, uh, you guys may heard about it. And just using the beacons placed down in the building, and we use our smartphone to detect the signal strain to determine where it is. So in our system, we features like a high accuracy. Uh, we tested about the, uh, the error rate about two meters, and it's low power consumption. Because each beacon use the button battery, they can uh, last up to two years uh, under their operations constantly. And it's uh, and interface friendly, because we design our apps just like for this example, we're using, it's just, Generally, it looks like you're using the Google Map or uh, other applications. It's very similar. And it's moderately low cost. Uh, each beacon costs about 10 to 20 bucks, and 10 beacons may cover like 4,000 square feet, something. And it sort of have a very big commercial potentials. Let's see what we can do under this system. Yeah, so maybe we can apply on the school, and you can sync with the schedule, and the students can use their app that can be finding their classroom at the right time. And also they're in the museum, uh, when the guests, the visitors come over the exhibitions and uh, the apps can show the details and specifications. Uh, and also similarly in the shopping mall, and the store can push up some promotions and discount informations, which enhance their shopping experience. And in the supermarket, uh, the people can just look up their items, what we want, uh, what they want, and it will guide them to the right slot. Yeah, and we decided to further developing our apps and to have those functions. And now we have a prototype. Oh, sorry. So now we have a prototype. Just uh, come to the booth to see our demos. Thank you.